Streaming live now on News8000.com. You're watching WKBT Lacrosse. This is News 8 Now at noon. Good afternoon and thanks for watching News 8 Now. I'm Dua Sharp. Identifying and preventing elder abuse. That's the goal of the Lacrosse County's Adult Protective Services. Today, APS invited officials from local organizations to learn more about elder abuse. This event is part of a four-year grant APS received. The grant is meant to help the county enhance current resources for elderly community members, as well as provide new ones. The La Crosse County APS supervisor says that elder abuse isn't talked about enough. Working in APS, I've come to somewhat of the conclusion that uh, Abuse in later life is somewhat of a forgotten social issue, um, but I can certainly say that it is present in our community. Treblehorn says APS receives close to 400 referrals of elder abuse each year. If you believe an elder you know is being abused, you can call Adult Protective Services at 608-785-5700. We'll have that number on our website, news8000.com. <laughs> Very cloudy and very gloomy here now with some widespread scattered showers moving across the Cooley region, but these are very, very light showers that continue to move through. Most of some of those lighter showers or showers in general have mainly moved off, moved their way off towards the east into Jackson, Clark, and also into Monroe County. There are some more showers, though, back towards the west that continue to move their way towards the east, so we may run to some of these here over the next few hours this afternoon. With current temperatures into the upper 50s, 59 in Winona, 58 La Crosse, 59 is the temperature currently in Eau Claire and 59 degrees now in Sparta. So here's City Cam 8 in La Crosse. You can see those thick, gloomy, cloudy conditions now. We're getting a bit of a break with some of those showers, but again, there are more chances of seeing more showers into the forecast here today with high temperatures mild into the 60s and south winds slightly breezy at around 10 to 15 miles an hour at times as well. I'll have a check on your full weather forecast in a few minutes and we'll uh, time out the rain details as far as uh, what's coming up here later this week here too. Quick Trip is still trying to get its reward program back online after a week-long outage. The company's latest update on Facebook says its internal systems are back online and that retail and customer-facing systems have not been impacted. It also says card payment processing has stayed secured. The company also says there's no evidence any third party has stolen any customer's personal information. Coming up at 5 and 6, News 8 Now's Jeremy Wall will be live with more details. $16 million, that's how much the Spring Grove Public School District is asking for in a two-bond referendum question. The school district held an informational public meeting last night to answer any of the public's question about the referendum. The first referendum question focuses on infrastructure updates. If that question passes, $12 million will be used on basic upgrades like a new HVAC system and pipe replacements. If the public supports the first question, the project could be expanded to include the second bond question. That one asked for an additional $4 million to build a new career technical education lab. Spring Grove superintendent says they really listen to the community when writing the referendum questions. Our community, when they were sur surveyed, said that's really important. Trades are huge and we need to be preparing our students to be entering into those fields and we need to upgrade our facility. The career tech Upgrades would allow more students to explore different trades. This is the first time the school district has had a referendum since the 80s. The public will be able to vote on the questions on November 7th. A major grant from Minnesota's Economic Development Agency will help Spring Grove rebuild after a major fire last winter. The state is granting $312,000 to help Spring Grove demolish and develop the site of the former True Value hardware store. The hardware store and the six apartments above it burned down in a fire just before Christmas last year. No one was injured in the fire, but it was a shock to Spring Grove's Main Street. This incoming grant money will redevelop the roughly quarter acre spot into a mixed use apartment building with 14 units. It will also create 7,500 square feet of commercial space, but it's unclear what kind of business or businesses could set up shop. Um, it's really hard to compete with some of the big box stores and Amazon and things like that. So we're trying to get creative about ways that we can maybe fill some of those needs for a hardware store in the community, like working with existing local businesses who can start to carry more things that the hardware store had. 
A group of local entrepreneurs brought, bought the built property from the old owner. Before this grant, the state also awarded a separate $250,000 grant to Spring Grove, so the two grants will now go a long way to helping the entrepreneurs revitalize the space. Project leaders hope to start redeveloping within the year. $275,000 in ARPA money is coming to support several lacrosse housing projects. The Neighborhood Revitalization Grant Review Committee has granted the money to several projects. $50,000 will help Habitat for Humanity build two homes. Another $50,000 goes to Cooley Cap Affordable Housing Project and fifty dollars more for La Crosse's Housing Replacement Program. The committee still has about $100,000 left to distribute. The Wisconsin Historical Society and Wisconsin PBS will be hosting a free screening of Wisconsin Pride tonight at the Rivoli Theater. According to a press release, the new documentary takes a look at some previously unknown Wisconsin LGBTQ plus stories and experiences. Some lacrosse area stories will also be featured in the film. Doors open at 6 tonight and the set show starts at 7. You can register for free tickets on the Rivoli Theater's website. A reminder that Milwaukee Burger Company's fundraiser Burgers for Boobs is today. The restaurant will donate $5 from every burger sold. There is a silent auction with a variety of prizes. A dunk tank will be arriving at 3 for any kids looking to make a splash. All of the proceeds from today's fundraiser will be going to local women battling breast cancer. Well, coming up on News 8 Now at noon, new research shows snoozing your alarm may actually be beneficial. And workers in another major industry are going on strike. How the companies are handling the walkout. That's after the break. Get 50% off lists during the big fall home sale at Slumberland Furniture and one of our best finance sales of the year. Pay no interest for three years. Get this stylish sectional for just $7.99, up to 50% off only at Slumberland Furniture. Hey, great big flat screen TV. Why is it so cold in here? You cold? You know you can warm this place up, don't you? You kidding me? Sure, American Home Fireplace and Patio can warm up a rec room, family room, home theater, or man cave with a gas fireplace from Fireplace Extraordinaire, Mendota, wood stoves like Blaze King, Pacific Energy, Lo-Fi. Didn't you know that? Should I? Do you always have to answer a question with a question? Doesn't everyone? American Home Fireplace and Patio. The weekend to-do list. It's a lot easier with the help of a John Deere 1 Series tractor. Attachments connect with ease, so you can knock out every task on your list. Whether you're moving earth, leveling a path, or mowing and mulching, one thing you're not doing is wrestling with the attachments. So you actually have time to enjoy your space and work on planning the next big project. John Deere 1 Series compact tractors. Versatile, easy, and affordable. Find yours at Tractor Central. It's a John Deere day. For over six decades, Blaine's Farm and Fleet's Toyland has made wishes come true for everyone. Now through Wednesday, we're celebrating with great gifts at great prices throughout the store. Like this rechargeable LED work light, just $17.99. This Nerf 2.0 double punch blaster, only $29.99. And assorted Dots home style snacks, just $4.99 each. Plus, make your Blaine's Christmas wish list on the Farm and Fleet app for a chance to win up to $1,000. Blaine's Farm and Fleet's Toyland, where wishes come true for everyone. The best products at the lowest prices during the Fall Home Show only at the Board Store. Always your home for high quality at lower prices. We bring you superior products installed by our exceptional team of installers. Replacement windows, patio doors, and entry doors. A new tub or shower or complete bath remodel. New cabinets, countertops, and flooring for your kitchen. The best in outdoor living decks, pergolas, and sunrooms. Beautiful exteriors with new siding and gutters. Visit, call, or connect online for the best products at the lowest prices during the Fall Home Show only at the Board Store Home Improvements. Don't miss it. Get 50% off lists during the Big Fall Mattress Sale at Slumberland. Incredible deals like a twin mattress for just $99 or our own private brand Slumbercrest as low as $299. Plus Sealy Posturepedic mattresses marked way down only at Slumberland. U.S. stocks had a mixed closing Tuesday after new federal data showed shoppers spent more than expected last month. In fact, the Commerce Department's report showed retail sales increased 0.7% for the month. The Dow gained 13 points, while the Nasdaq fell 34 and the S&P 500 dipped to less than a point. CBS News' Jared Hill has the latest business headlines from New York. 
The IRS will test a free electronic tax filing software next year. Arizona, California, Massachusetts, and New York are the first states where the pilot will be tested. Americans typically spend around $11 billion each year on tax preparation services. Around 3,700 casino workers in Detroit walked off the job Tuesday after the casinos and unions failed to reach a deal for better wages. All three of the affected casinos, the MGM Grand, Motor City Casino Hotel, and Hollywood Casino at Greektown, say they'll stay open despite the strike. The move comes more than a month after auto workers in Michigan and some other states began targeted strikes against the big three U.S. automakers. And soon, some lucky bidders may be able to follow the Yellow Brick Road to an auction of rare items from the Wizard of Oz film. The family of actor Ray Bolger, who played the Scarecrow, is selling the sheet music to the songs Over the Rainbow and If I Only Had a Brain. Those items, along with letters and cards from former First Lady Jackie Kennedy Onassis, Britain's Queen Mother, and Harry Houdini, are all part of the auction from Lionheart Autographs, which will run until November 1st. That's your CBS News Money Watch report. For more, log on to CBSMoneyWatch.com. At the CBS Broadcast Center, I'm Jared Hill. Well, that's it for your afternoon consumer news. As we head to break, here is a live look at the New York Stock Exchange. Stay with us. More news is next. Window World is here to help. We're making it easy with special financing options and convenient monthly payments. Increase your curb appeal with energy-efficient products that have earned the good housekeeping seal. Window World, America's exterior remodeler. Is your home missing the warm glow of a fireplace? You want one, but you're not sure where to start? Contact La Crosse Fireplace Company today. We'll design more than just your heat and glow fireplace. We'll help you pick the perfect stone, mantle, and hearth, making your heat and glow fireplace the focal point and cozy gathering space of your home. Stop into our showroom for inspiration or give us a call for a free in-home estimate. La Crosse Fireplace Company, Mormon Cooley Road, because your place is by the fire. Chunk Gaming Black River Falls presents Piano Men, a tribute to Elton John and Billy Joel. Friday night, October 27th. Don't miss Piano Men. $40 tickets at Ticketmaster include $15 rewards play. Piano Men, a tribute to Elton John and Billy Joel. Is everybody feeling home? Only at Ho Chunk Gaming Black River Falls. Must be 21 years or older to attend. Our homes are extensions of who we are. New beginnings, first steps, moments lasting in time. We'll be there. Window World, America's exterior remodeler. Improving homes, changing lives. Every day, our commitment begins again. Sun up to sundown. Building trust the way it should be done. Sticking to the facts and reporting the story fairly and equally and telling the stories of our community. But it doesn't end when the newscast is done. We're always on and where you can find us. The source you rely on. News 8 Now. Expect more. What hitting the snooze button means for your health and could robots make us lazier? Christian Benavides has some of the day's top health stories. A helping hand from robots may lead to social loafing. That's when someone becomes accustomed to another's high performance, so they relax and let others do the work. Scientists in Berlin split participants into two groups to look for errors in a circuit board. Those who were told they had the help of robots that already inspected the board found fewer errors, while those who were told they were working on their own found more errors. New research from Rutgers University shows adults with ADHD are three times more likely to develop dementia. The study followed 100,000 adults for nearly two decades, finding even when other risk factors are taken into account, adult ADHD is associated with significantly higher dementia risk. The findings suggest ADHD treatment may reduce that elevated risk.
And it appears those who snooze, in fact, do not lose. That's according to a new Swedish study that looked at adults who use intermittent alarms to get in a few more minutes of sleep in the morning. The data shows some participants who were able to snooze for 30 minutes or more had improved cognitive tests compared to those who woke up abruptly. But we should point out, while snoozing may have some benefits for the snoozer, it's likely an annoying habit for any non-snoozing partner. Those are some of today's top health stories. Cristian Benavides, CBS News, Miami. Lucky for me, I hit the snooze button every morning. Well, that's it for our medical news today. Here is a look at CityCam 8. Derek is in next with our forecast. During the fall savings event at PM Sleep Center, save up to $900 on select Beautyrest Black and select Black Hybrid Adjustable Mattress Sets. Your next mattress is at PM Sleep Center, giving LaCrosse a good night's sleep for over 35 years. Is it time for new carpet in your home or business? Then it's time to visit Carpets To Go. As Wisconsin's premier flooring sales, Carpets To Go has the best in selection and name brands. There's a lot to consider when choosing the best carpet for you. With a tremendous selection and expert advice, you won't go wrong. Tile flooring adds beauty and style to any area. It's low maintenance and resistant to scratches and stains. With free estimates and design, financing and installation available. There's no better choice than Carpets To Go at their convenient location in Onalaska. At Toma Health, we're helping patients rest through the night with our accredited sleep services. We offer diagnostic testing and treatment for a range of sleep disordered breathing, anywhere from obstructive and central sleep apnea to insomnia, narcolepsy, and much more. I feel so much better. I sleep all night. You know, I was up and ready to go. So alarm goes off, or now I beat the alarm up. Visit Toma Health Sleep Services for a better night's sleep. Get 11% off everything at Menards and take care of all your automotive needs. From tools and accessories to maintenance and everything in between. Wiper blades? Copy that. Motor oil? Done. Trust Menards to help out with all your automotive needs. Get superior engine protection with Valvoline High Mileage Motor Oil. It's a synthetic blend to maximize engine life in vehicles over 75,000 miles. Pick up a quart for only $3.99 after 11% rebate. Save big money at Menards. During the fall savings event at PM Sleep Center, save up to $900 on select Beautyrest Black and select Black Hybrid Adjustable Mattress Sets. Your next mattress is at PM Sleep Center, giving LaCrosse a good night's sleep for over 35 years. Don't be tricked by sales and free stuff. Better products and better prices on all your home improvements during the 2023 Fall Home Show at the Board Store Home Improvements. Don't miss it. News 8, your home for Super Bowl 58. Scattered showers continue across the Cooley region now as we head into this afternoon. And if we put this into motion, you can see where they're moving, mainly towards the east and at northeast. There are some more uh, scattered showers back towards the west that are moving in our direction. So we'll be looking at those here in the next uh, few minutes. But all these showers, though, in general, are extremely light associated with this low pressure system back towards the west. You can see there is a uh, trailing cold front associated with the system here as well. As this continues to move in, it will help continue to spawn cloud cover and shower activity across the Cooley region throughout the day today with uh, temperature readings into the 60s with some of those scattered showers and cloud cover around 63 degrees around 5 o'clock here today with some of those showers. Here's sky tracker around 4 o'clock. You can see those scattered showers that continue to move through. Otherwise, we may see a little bit of some breaks here in the clouds and showers as we head into tonight and also into overnight. The clouds uh, will start to return 9 o'clock tomorrow morning. Looking at some mostly cloudy skies, a couple of light showers are possible mainly off towards the north and then by 4 o'clock tomorrow it does look like some more scattered rain showers are a possibility. The models here have uh, indicated that it may not be looking at more widespread compared to what we had here from the previous runs, but still an indication though we will be looking at some rain chances nonetheless once again as we head into tomorrow. But by tomorrow night, I do think that most of the rain showers should come to a close. Very light rainfall accumulations with some of these showers moving through less than a tenth of an inch here or so in uh, many spots. City Cam 8 and La Crosse definitely off to that cloudy start. Uh, 58 degrees now is 
is the temperature with south winds at around uh, 11 miles an hour. 5.72 feet is the river stage. 59 degrees currently in Eau Claire. South southeast winds at 14. We have seen some gusts report up to 22 miles an hour at the airport. Uh, keep in mind the roads uh, looking a little bit wet out there here for your afternoon lunch hour commute. Uh, current temperatures into the upper 50s, low 60s. Not quite done warming up just yet. I think we will reach those low to mid 60s. Uh, come this afternoon with 61 in Eau Claire and a high of 64 degrees today in La Crosse. Here's a check now on your eight day forecast and we will keep those slight rain chances uh, for tomorrow. Uh, slimmer, slimmer chances that is as we head into Friday uh, with mainly a mix of clouds and sun for Friday and also into this weekend well, lasting us into early next week on Monday. Next best chance of rain coming probably on Tuesday and Wednesday of next week, but those highs uh, mainly into the upper 50s, if not low 60s, lows in the 40s. Slumber chances. Slumber chances, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> Sleeping weather, yeah. Yes, definitely. Yeah. Oh, yeah, rain is meant to stay at home. Yeah, of course. And, and Snuggle up snuggle. and just chill. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. yeah, watch the movies. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks, Derek. Yep. When we come back, the giving season has already begun. How one lacrosse staple is preparing for Christmas. That's coming up next. Home and Locker and Meat Market, your place for fresh, quality, local meat. Now's the time to stock up with our fall bundle. Call and order yours today. Eat healthy, shop local at your Home and Locker and Meat Market, and much, much more. Walt never smoked a day in his life, so when he developed a bad cough, we never thought lung cancer, but that's what it was. What gives a non-smoker lung cancer? A friend suggested we check the house for radon. Sure enough, it was high. We've had it taken care of now, but I wish we'd known sooner. Walt died four weeks and five days after the diagnosis. If you haven't had your home checked for radon, do it. Do it for your family. No one should lose someone they love because of this. Here in La Crosse County, we at Maxwell White understand the importance of home comfort, which is why we've been serving our community with the best in plumbing and bathroom remodeling services for nearly 30 years. We pride ourselves on making each and every one of our customers feel safe, comfortable, and happy in their homes. So remember, when it comes to your home's plumbing needs, Maxwell White strives to provide our customers with a positive experience every time. Maxwell White, plumbing done right. Ready to transform your space? Or perhaps your favorite room just needs a few updates? Let our design consultants help you discover the possibilities to update your home. We take the time to discuss your space, your needs, and your budget. Cooley Carpet will help you every step of the way, from start to finish, with design professionals and expert installation to meet all your expectations. Let our dedicated team help you achieve your dream space. Visit us at Cooley Carpet Center on Mormon Cooley Road in La Crosse. Start your holiday shopping with the Holman Locker and Meat Market. Order a double smoked ham, prime rib, fresh turkey, or smoked salmon. Create a custom gift basket. Don't forget the beer and the best beef jerky for your get-together. Holman Locker and Meat Market and much, much more. You never know who you're helping by sharing your story. And like people think y'all look alike, you can be our son. I love Jennifer. Weekdays at 4 on News 8. Download the News 8000 app today. You're watching News 8 Now. Expect more. Rotary Lights have announced their plans for the 29th anniversary of their holiday lights display at Riverside Park. Volunteers started setting up lights in the park Monday, which will take about six weeks to complete. The display will feature over 3 million lights, nightly visits from Santa, carriage rides, s'mores, and even a few new surprises. We do have a new, uh, a few new animated displays that, uh, that you'll see in the park as well. We have some uh, uh, live animals that will be joining our live nativity scene down in the park as well. And one of the big changes is we're expanding our entertainment in the big tent. Those entertainment acts will include the Harp Twins, John Smith, and a few other notable acts. The display will be open November 24th and will run through New Year's Eve. This event helps the Rotary Lights mission of feeding the hungry in the Cooley region. This year, proceeds from their teddy bear sales will go towards providing meals and snacks for the Boys and Girls Club. Stay with us. We'll have one more check of your forecast when we return. Get 
Get your new flooring before the holidays. At Interior Designs, we have the flooring to fit your style and budget. Our designers will help you pick out the perfect carpet, ceramic tile, or laminate. Contact Interior Designs today to have your new flooring installed before the holidays. A distracted driver turned left in front of me and I was ejected off my motorcycle. Sean knew he had only one opportunity to call the best. I called Hoopy and Abraham because they specialize in motorcycle accidents. They fought for me and they got me more than I expected. Find out what Sean and thousands of other bikers already know. Hoopy and Abraham means business. In my opinion, Hoopy and Abraham is the best law firm in the Midwest. They really do mean business. Call the motorcycle accident lawyers at Hoopy and Abraham. Are record energy costs putting a squeeze on your fixed or limited incomes? With inflation rising at record levels and incomes not keeping pace, you might be one of tens of thousands of Wisconsin residents who are struggling to survive in the blistering heat of summer or the bitter cold of winter. While you haven't asked for it, the Keep Wisconsin Warm Cool Fund and your local energy assistance providers are here to help. No Wisconsin resident should ever have to face the challenge of living without heat or power or face homelessness. For a hand up, apply today and call 1-800-506-5596. That's 800-506-5596. Or visit www.kwwf.org. At Interior Designs, we'll help you design your new kitchen from start to finish. Our selection of showplace cabinetry, countertops, flooring, and backsplashes are sure to fit your style and budget. Contact Interior Designs today and get started on your dream kitchen or bathroom. You live a life on demand. Movies, shows, and more. Your local news, weather, and sports shouldn't be different. The 8000 Plus app is the free streaming option, giving you everything local on your time. If you have one of these, you can get this. The 8000 Plus app. Stream on your time. Final check now on your eight day forecast, looking at some scattered rain showers uh, through at least tomorrow. Slim chance here for Friday, but for the most part, that's when I think we will dry out. Heading into this weekend, mixed clouds and sun that will last into early next week on Monday with those seasonable high temperatures there. Next best chance of rain probably not coming until Tuesday and Wednesday of next week. Highs in those 50s and low 60s, and we got lows into the 40s. Definitely keep that rain gear with you. Yeah, I think you'll need it here, at least for, for some of those off and on rain showers here today. So not a bad idea to keep the umbrella in. All righty. Yeah. Well, thank you for watching News 8 Now at noon. We'll see you back here later tonight at 5, 6, and 10. Have a wonderful Wednesday.